welcome back to my channel it's your girl naturally charlotte sounds like charlotte didn't it <laughs> but it's christmas eve guys it's christmas eve i thought i wasn't gonna be in the christmas spirit but your girl has caught this christmas spirit obviously you know i don't know if you know i'm actually in London, we're tier four. I don't know if you know about the tier system, but it means we're basically like Hunger Games up in this bitch. Like it is crazy. We can't see nobody do anything, blink, work out, nothing. It's literally like it's pretty much like the when we first went into lockdown. It's crazy. I'll catch you up on that another video, but yeah. Um, I'm just spending Christmas with my boyfriend this year in our new place. That's another thing that's changed. Um, I moved, so I'll be sharing that with you. See guys, I told you I had so much stuff happening in 2020 that I'll be sharing with you. Because of that, I am literally not spending with my family, which is like sad because we have certain traditions. But um, instead, me and my boyfriend are going to make our, our own tradition because it's the first Christmas that we're spending as just us two. So that's really nice and I'm super excited about that. But anyways, let's get into this video because, you know, we don't want these videos to be too long. And, you know, editing is long, guys. Like, oh. But as you can tell from the title, I will be sharing with you guys me using some of the naughty products which is this brand it's called naughty i love the packaging the packaging is so cute like oh look at this oh so gorgeous but yeah i'll be sharing with you guys um some of the products that i used from this brand and i do have an affiliate code for those who don't know what affiliate code is it's basically you get a percentage off and by you using the code that's linked to me i get some money back i got a few items now in my collection and so i thought with having so much stuff i might as well share with you my thoughts on the product i have been using it for a while and if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that I did a uh, twist out. And because of that, a lot of people have said, can I break down how I've used the products and the twist out. And then recently I got sent a new product that they've just launched, which is the um, scrunching jelly, gilet, which is so cute. Um, so I thought, why not do a review slash twist out so you i can like show you guys both things so basically if you haven't already watched my video that i put out recently i'm reviewing the d ali organics products this that was the start of the video so i use those two to shampoo and condition this video begins from where i deep condition and style my hair so i've said enough let's just jump into it okay guys picking up where we left the d ali organics video i'm using to the rescue um deep conditioner by naughty um i use quite a lot to start with um just because i haven't used it in a while but then it reminded me how great this deep conditioner is like honestly my hair was so easy to manage and as before guys the best way to get a product to soak into your hair is to do your hair in sections and to also twist that product into your hair this is what i'm doing now and you can see that i am loving how my hair is feeling so basically i just repeat those steps again guys and then i leave the deep conditioner in my hair for 15 minutes so let's speed this up shall we so here i am returning back to the shower after letting the deep conditioner sit in my hair for 15 minutes and i'm just unraveling the full twist that i did and honestly guys like surely you can see how soft my hair is it's so moisturized that all my curls are just hanging loose it's oh it's unbelievable like this is one of my top top deep conditioners 
okay guys and then i like to rinse out my deep conditioner with cold water or as cold as you can take it it just locks in that moisture and gives your hair amazing shine after rinsing out the deep conditioner thoroughly i like to split my hair back into those four sections and then get out the shower and apply my leave-in sometimes i like to do this underneath the shower but honestly guys i completely forgot that i had a leave-in in this line so i'm gonna do this outside of the shower okay guys so after getting out the shower i apply the leave-in conditioner this leave-in is super nice i completely forgot about this leave-in um, so I'm getting familiar with these products myself so I just basically put a dollop in my hand this is the consistency it's really nice and then I apply that to a section of my hair twist up my hair and do that repeatedly for all four sections I also make sure I brush this product through my hair with my tangle teaser um, just to apologize guys about the lighting and um, from this point on we'll keep dipping in and out so I just want to say sorry about that from now all right my love so next up we have the curl defining taming cream um, this is probably my least favorite um, product in the line um, though it's buttery and it's got a really good consistency it smells nice I just didn't see a benefit for compared to the other two products so it's good but i didn't really care for it all that much so basically i just apply it to all four sections and work that in my hair twist it up and repeat all over my head so that's what i'll be doing now lastly i'll be applying the scrunching jelly chili um at first i have to admit i was going to try doing a wash and go with the same method because the application is the same but after realizing this jelly had no hold or giving my hair no definition this is when i decided that i'm going to do a twist out instead so for a perfect twist out you have to make sure your hair is really smooth i like to do this with my tangle tweezer making sure that my hair is smooth all the way down and just keep on twisting. So I basically just repeat that same step all over my hair, which takes a while. So I'll speed this up and then I'll come back and after a few days when my hair is dry and we'll take those twists down. this is my whole head covered in twist and I leave this in for about two days to dry all right guys so you know as you can see the products are bum dee dee bum like it's I love it I love it I wasn't very blown away by the scrunch and gelée and the reason why I decided to put some in my twist is because it had no tack so I assume it will have no hold I was trying to at first I was actually going to do a wash and go using this product but as you can see in parts of the video it just did not work out like my curls were not doing what it needs to in for definition so I was like nope so what I thought is I'll just use a little bit to try and secure my twist so let's get into it guys. I'm gonna basically take down my twist now. All right guys, so I've just grabbed my um, oil mix. In my oil mix I got castor oil, coconut oil, vitamin E oil, avocado oil, don't know if I've just said that, and almond oils. It's some of my favorite oils, they're really light, they're really great, love it. And then a few drops of lavender. All right, guys. So to basically take down my twist, I, I just basically keep my hair in sections, just so it doesn't cause frizz, and I pull out a twist at a time. Put a little bit of oil on my hands. This prevents frizz, guys. So if any time you're thinking that your twist out is frizzy, put some oils on your hand. Okay. 
So I like to just run the oil down my hair and do a coil with my hair. This just kind of juice back up the twist and cause and those like frizz areas that you like you get whilst your twist is drying out um over a couple of days will just kind of like fall back into place so that's what i like to do the key for not making your ends frizzy is to just kind of like uncoil it you know because i coil my ends to secure it so you just want to uncoil it with the oil which prevents the frizz so let's get into that. See? Look at that definition, honey. So I like to work with quite small twist. And then what I like to do is I don't separate like that and fluff it up. I just kind of take my hands where the hair, you see, it naturally like breaks by itself. I just separate it using like that. see that already and it just basically you keep your definition and you get less frizz hopefully guys this works out really nicely for me because i my twist outs have been getting a bit crazy late you know before so i stopped doing them and i went straight back to wash and goes so i'm hopeful for this <laughs> otherwise i'm going to wake up really early and wash my hair and do a wash and go because it's christmas morning it's gonna be Christmas morning and I want a cute picture on Christmas day and if this don't turn out right I ain't gonna be happy so so let's do that again and what's another tip guys is when you do your twist just so you can separate them really well make sure they're at this like it's good to have your hair quite leveled that way your twists are even so when you pull it apart to separate then your hair don't get caught and um, you don't cause frizz basically the key for a good twist out is to stop frizz so what I've noticed because obviously you guys know that I use the, um, the scrunchion jelly basically this jelly is not giving me anything like gel feel or anything like that my hair feels actually really soft um, so I don't know if it will be a product that you would style as a wash and go because your hair will just, it has no hold. <laughs> it has no hold. So I'm going to keep doing that, doing what I'm doing, taking my hair down. So I like to separate really well from day one and that way I don't have to go over it because over the coming days it's going to get more and more frizzy and then by you touching it it's going to be more frizzy so i like to just separate really well on the first day and just let my hair do does what it wants to do between now and my next wash day so that's another tip guys so as you can see i'm basically going to continue that method pulling one down oiling my hands running the oil along the hair kind of uncoiling separating and then let him to lay by itself and then i'll come back and show you the end results of that and uh, we'll see if this twist towel is good enough for christmas morning let's see shall we the twist towel towel back so i'm not going to pick it out tonight because i definitely think it's a success and i want to pick it out as much as possible tomorrow for christmas morning because this is definitely going to be my Christmas look I think yeah I'm just gonna basically do the same thing again to this side and then come back and show you the end result but guys if you've gotten this far already and you're liking what you see so far go ahead and subscribe because it's gonna be more of this goodness to come okay all right so subscribe and hit the notification bell that's all I need from you all right I'm gonna do this side and then show you the end result all right guys so this is the end result the definition is real the length is here to stay and my twist outs are back let me try to show you back 
Okay, all right, so I am loving these results. And let me tell you, I've used these products before, except for the scrunching jelly. And I didn't get this great of a result. Like the result was great, I loved it. But this is extra lovely, you know? Um, so I definitely think it has something to do with the scrunching jelly, which is the new product from Naughty. Again, guys, if you want a percentage off, it will be linked in the description box. You get 15% by using the code NaturallyC15. And you get some money off your purchase. So, you know, try it. Let me know what you think. Because um, I personally love the brand. The results speak for themselves. Um, I'll try and come back and insert a clip of me with how my hair kept up on Christmas morning and throughout the week. If I don't do that, then obviously check out my Instagram because your girl is always on there and I'm always sharing pictures and so forth. And you know, I'm always in my stories. Like my stories never time out. So if you want more of me and want to see more of me, then follow me on Instagram. And my Instagram is at naturally underscore Charlotte. Make sure you spell Charlotte right because otherwise you won't find me, okay? But yeah, this is it guys. Oh, look at that, I can like, I might do like, oh, that's a look, oh, that's a look. Oh my God, that's a vibe. Oh, maybe I'll do a side, oh, that's a vibe, oh my God. Oh, okay, I'm gonna go because clearly I'm feeling myself. But if you love these results, remember to subscribe hit the notification bell, a like, comment down below what you want to see from me next and I hope you guys have a happy holidays. Love, peace out. Alright guys, take care, happy holidays. Huddle a little bit closer, babe